going to review how to use log negative log plots to assess the proportional hazards assumption in Stata. Suppose we're using the same example restricting to those aged 40 to 44 in Framingham and looking at time to death. In the last tutorial, we fit a Cox model with current smoking status, age, and systolic blood pressure. To assess the proportional hazards assumption, we can either assess it using an unadjusted log negative log plot or an adjusted plot. To make this plot, we go to statistics, survival analysis, regression models, graphically assess proportional hazards assumption. Suppose the first thing we want to do is graphically assess the proportional hazards assumption looking only at the current smoking variable, so cur smoke one. This is going to be an unadjusted log negative log plot. When I look at this plot, I see that the hazards never cross in this case, and it looks like maybe they're getting a little bit closer over time, but in general, they look pretty parallel, so I wouldn't be too concerned about a violation of the proportional hazards assumption just looking at this unadjusted log negative log plot. To make the model more reflective of what we're actually fitting, we would want to adjust for certain covariates. So we have included age and systolic blood pressure at baseline in our model. So what we can do is adjust the log negative log plot for those covariates by including those in the adjustment variables window. As discussed in class, we're going to adjust to the average values of the adjustment variables. So we're really predicting log negative log survival at the average value of age and systolic blood pressure exam one. And the adjusted plot, just eyeballing it, even seems to look a little bit better. It looks like we get a little bit more parallelness in the um, log negative log plot. So it does appear that proportional hazards is not severely violated for current smoking at baseline.